Hello, my name is Hurriyet Neshet Aytuan. I am the CEO and founder of Planet Tech Environment Treatment Technologies. We are in Istanbul at Bosphorus University, right by the Black Sea, at one of our wastewater treatment plants, which is by Planet Tech. It is one of the most sustainable wastewater treatment plants. Why? Because it consumes very small amount of energy, especially when you compare to the activated sludge systems. Let me show you why. Please come with me. Now, before this treatment plant, there was another recent treatment plant here. It was an activated slide system, and it was 12.5 times two blowers, which is approximately 25 kilo. But in here, we have 0.37 kilowatts. 0.37 to 0.55, and we have eight of them eight units so that makes approximately 2.5 kilowatts so when you compare 2.5 versus 25 it's more than 90 percent of energy saved now we are one of the 20 companies in the world with a registered rbc brand we have services in 11 countries and very soon in australia that will be number 12 hopefully and let me show you what makes this system so special? Okay, let's go. Okay, in an activated sludge system, what you have is a blower, which gives oxygen to the wastewater. Here, let me show you. This is the window, just to look inside. You can see that there are disks, PP disks, rotating at three RPM, at very slow RPM and the bacteria sticks to the surface of the discs requires oxygen and what happens is it's got windows at the top it's got windows on the side and the air enters through those windows and the bacteria meets the oxygen and it does the oxidizing it does the digestion which is biological waste for a treatment plant it is very simple now because of this now there are so many complicated systems like MBR, MBBR, or other systems, reverse osmosis. What makes the system so beautiful is the sheer simplicity. As a matter of fact, on our catalogs and on our models, we have Leonardo da Vinci's words, which is, simplicity is the ultimate sophistication. What makes the system so beautiful? Here is our brand, Planet Disc. Now it is registered all over the world. And like I said, we are in several countries for 14 years now. It goes through the first system, the wastewater, then it comes to the second unit, depending on what the capacity. Now in this unit or in this plant, we have 3,500 people, that's the capacity. And each unit, depending on how dirty the water is and how clean you want, it is approximately 250 to 500 people per unit. Okay. Let's go back and we will, I will show you the very last unit, which is lamella separator, which is final sedimentation tank. Okay, now one more time. The wastewater goes to the first unit and then the second planet disk unit, RBC unit, and it goes to the final sedimentation tank. It's a lamella separator. Requires no energy, no moving parts. Now I want to take a sample water with you. Here's the bottle. And I'm going to wash the bottle and make sure that there is nothing stuck on the nozzle. And let's see. Beautiful. Beautiful. Please take a look at it. No filtration, no chemicals. This is what you get from wastewater and we are very proud of it. Okay, now, we have to dewater the sludge coming out of the sedimentation tank, so we do have a filter press. When the system is big, or the capacity is big, you will need dewater. In small places, if you take the sludge, I would say probably every six months or seven months with a suction track, it will be plenty enough. But if it is a system like 3,000 people just like this, or 3,500, then yes, we will need filter press. By the way, we use, or the authorities use, 
the owner of the plant uses the treated water partially for uh, irrigation and the rest of it goes directly to the Black Sea after treatment. Now, what do we get in analysis? We usually get 15, 20, 25 BOD. That is plenty enough for the water regulations. One of the most important issues of 21st century is water and environment. Since 2004, we are serving the environment. We may not be one of the biggest, largest companies in the world, but we surely are one of the most important companies for the world. I thank you so much for watching this short video, short introduction, and let us help you serve your environment, save your water, use the water, reuse the water for irrigation purposes or other purposes with our most sustainable RBC technology. German technology, 100% made in Turkey, and with excellent references like Veolia, like Aramco, Metito, Unilever, BP, and several local companies in Turkey as well. Once again, thank you, and we're looking forward to hearing from you.